Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel once again. I'm here to share with you um, a project that I recently made and also to show you a small um, Aliexpress dies that I have um, received lately and I'm going to go ahead and show you first some of the dies and then I will show share with you my project and the rest of the dice I got from there. I have them uh, in the project. So let's get started with this die, which is a doily. And I pre cut this die cut, and as you can see, it's very pretty. I'm gonna give you a closer view. As you saw, for the paper it shines a little, but as you can see, it cuts and embossed really good. So this is this die. The next one is going to be this love word. So you better see it this way. And this is the die cut you are going to have with this die. As you can see, it has a good size. So, the next one is going to be this die, which is a heart. And emboss these uh, lines. And you can use it for as a tag for... Um, memorabilia or small messages in your albums or whatever you want to do and this is the die cut you're gonna have as you can see I made it in the foil paper and you can appreciate um, you can notice how good embossed all the details so this would be this die and for the next ones I'm gonna show you the dice and I'm gonna show you where I use them on my project. So the next die is gonna be this beautiful heart. And when this you're gonna have two pieces of it die cut. So this is gonna be the two pieces. This is the center, I mean the outside, and this is the center heart. So when you cut it, you will have something like this and then it's going to get separated. I love this one because it's very beautiful. Next time, I mean, the next one is going to be this border, which is very gorgeous. And this is the die cut you're going to have with this. And I also used this one on my project and I'm going to show you how it looks. So this is the cut, the die cut and as you can see cuts perfectly. And last, I didn't make the die cut for these frames but you're going to see it, some of them on my project. This is going to be the biggest die of the set and this is the size. As you can see it's almost my full hand. This is the other si uh, size. And I use on my project these two for uh, my stamp. My personalized stamp. So you're gonna see how it looks. This is the other one. And these are the two smaller. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I did and how I use a couple of these dies on my project. So let's get started. What I'm going to show you now is my very first explosion box. For make this explosion box, I got inspiration from the channels of Rosa Kelly scrapbooking and Aula DIY. Um, 
I'm gonna show you what I did. Oh, as always, I made my own style, my own. Uh, I use my own uh, creation for decorate these, and this project is for um, one person that have been helping us in a process that my family is into, and as a thank you to her. I create this for her. So she is not a scrappy person, but uh, I try to make this um, in an easy way for her to just put her pictures and that's it. I made it a um, family theme, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I did. So this is the top of the box of the lid, and I use many flowers, these are foam flowers and I used some of the um, some from the Hobby Lobby wedding section which is this, this and this one and I got this pin from my friend uh, Wanna Scrap this is also from uh, Hobby Lobby wedding section and I got this also from their Hobby Lobby and this opens up and I made this cut I got this shape and she can just pull out the cut, stick a picture on it for the perfect size and um, she just stick it in there and she will have a picture of her kids or whatever she want to put it there and this goes up like this and it says cherish your family for they are your treasure, your God given will be all measure so here I get a small um, bit that I had from Aliexpress, it says happy, I don't know if you can appreciate it. So I'm going to give you a view of the sides. This is going to be the front size and I use these stickers that says love my family and I decorate all this with this, with um, bling and this flower that I got from my friend Barbie this prima flower and some bling all around some uh, trims and then these are this is one of the sizes this is the other side I got this beautiful lace from my friend Barbie also it's a big one so I just cut it in half and stick it there and this is the back and here you can see two of those dies the two uh, medium sizes of the die these two of the frame die I, these are these two sizes and I use it for my stamp as you can see it's dimensional so I'm gonna go ahead and open the box let me see if I can Okay, I hope you can see it very well like that. So, this opens up like this. And this is going to be my explosion box. I'm going to start with this side. Because I have to open this too. So, these are the sizes. I made this tag. So, this size and this size are identical almost identical. I made just small changes and this is one photo spot and I get this in the other side. She can place pictures here, pictures here and pictures also here and put it underneath. This opens up like this and this opens up like this and like this so I use those two tutorials and finally came up with this and do it on my own way so 
I use this also opens up in this way and she can place pictures here so here I'm gonna try to show you the back size of this this is identical to this one and I just add this that says remember this so this side and this size in the back I'm gonna show you this says together and has these rosettes that says happy and the other side says forever and I make a small decoration with this I hope you can see it so in this side I made this she has two uh, children one boy and one girl and I made one photo mat for each one of them so this is the one in this side and this is for her girl one says 100% boy and 100% girl oh I forgot to tell you that this is also uh, an Aliexpress dies for tags I don't have it here right now because it's already packed because I am moving on guys to my new house and I have all my stuff already in boxes so let's keep going the next one is a uh, um, spandex um, like accordion pocket and I made four I made four photo mats small ones four packets and each one has a photo mat she can place pictures in each one of them and for this I use a collection from color book which is very pretty I don't remember exactly now the name of it but I can show you um I can show it to you later because it's already in one inside of a box and so I put this sticker here that says family is love family is a circle of love and for these I used um, small envelopes regular envelope but the small one I cut it in half and I stick four pieces and I have this spandex I use I made a pocket here and I use this trim and the other side is exactly the same and I got this tag uh, from my friend Barbie and as, it's, and as it says thank you I'm gonna use this for leave her a small note thanking her for all her help in all this process that we have been going through so this is exactly the same that this side and these are the pockets which I made these uh, photo mats these are blank in, this, in the back but as you can see these is this die that I already show you I cut two and stick them together and I just, you can see I have the back and the front and the front sorry so this goes in here and it looks very pretty very fancy so and then I have in this size I don't know if you okay let's do it this way this opens up like this and I got these flowers uh, you can you can't see it okay I have these handmade flowers for my friend Barbie and uh, I use some trim here and stick that flower in there and this opens up like this and I add some corners and make this this is the vine uh, dye from Aliexpress and this part I think on it for her and her husband so she can play small pictures of her and her husband here small pictures she can add also pictures here 
and this is a pop up. Uh, this is a pop up photo mat. So the other side is identical, but I made it for her kids. So I tried to make places for her own pictures and her kids' pictures. So this opens up like this with the same decoration and I leave it in blank and she can use it for her kids' pictures or some other pictures of her family as she wants. So this clothes is exactly the same decoration and I use ribbon to make the closure and then this side this is the back of the side of that side and it's identical in the both sizes so I'm gonna show you just one and I made this photo mat this is a small booklet I leave it in blank in the back and she can use the she can place a picture and just have the um, white edge on it and this is exactly the same than the other side then moving along keep, let's keep with this part and I made this photo mat I forgot to tell you that this is a 6x6 um, explosion box and this side is for her children it says children put a twinkle in our eyes and a smile in, our, in your heart so this is just for pictures of her kids and this opens up like this and I have this trim here she can place a small tag here or small pictures underneath the trim and place a big picture here and I have a pocket which with a photo mat let's see if I can oh goes inside come here lady okay I got it uh, So this is the photo mat inside, picture here, journal in the back or picture in the back as she wants. And these are, um, this is a Aliexpress punch, border punch, as you can see it's very pretty. I shared this in one of the of my old hauls. So this is this side and this is the other side and is for her um, and her husband and this die is the other one I use just the one of with the edge edges and I stick it in back and stick this uh, sticker that says you and me with a small piece of foam in back so this also opens up like this for pictures and like that and it's exactly the same that the other side with the photo mat in there so this close like this and it's magnetized and I'm gonna show you then this size which is um, this is a waterfall and this opens up like this and I have place for one two four four six eight and nine pictures on the waterfall. This goes like this and I have a photo mat underneath the waterfall. And I leave this in blank because she can write in here whatever she wants, some memorabilia or memories of the picture she's putting on. So and I'm gonna show you this back side of this and it's another photo mat and I'm gonna give you a close view I'm gonna 
do it by myself because so this as you can see is the Eiffel Tower and says which and hope I decorate I got this from Aliexpress is the Eiffel Tower as you can see it's a tiny Eiffel Tower and I did decorate this with uh, flowers also from Aliexpress some rain stones from um, Hobby Lobby and this is one of those long um, uh, 3D stickers and I just cut it and put it all around this circle I got like three circles and use foam underneath and made this uh, piece here dimensional piece here so this is what I came up with and then I'm gonna close this like that put the small gift in there again and this is the closure and then this close like this and I'm gonna put and this is the inside of the box so I'm gonna put the lid on again And as you can see, I made it easy for her to put, take, choose just the pictures she wants to add on it and add it. Just cut it, cut them, and stick it on the photo mats. So I hope she likes it. I hope you like guys likes it too. Give me some thumbs up for this, and I will link all the. Um, dice I show you this time on the description box so if you are interested in some of them you can just go ahead and make click on the make a click on the link and get some of these dice this works perfect for um, your projects and I will share in some more in other hauls because I'm waiting some more. So I hope you like this project share and this haul of dice. And I hope to see you guys soon. So give me some thumbs up. And if you like my project, please go ahead and subscribe and leave me your lovely comments. See you next time. Bye bye.